Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep Final Mix and <laughs> I actually have a pretty interesting story to tell but I'm going to save that for when we do Neverland with Aqua. So yeah, it's a pretty, yeah, it's not really an interesting or long story but uh, yeah. Anyway, let's uh, vis visit Neverland. It, come it comes back since... The first time it's been here in Kingdom Hearts 1 and Chain of Memories. So yeah, let's see what's going on. <laughs> what are they, Captain? Back! You must get me, treasure! Leave them to me. I should mention a few things, like the Keyblade that Terra is using. I got that by doing a mission in the Mirage Arena. It's actually a pretty good Keyblade. So, I can't remember what the... It's like the best Keyblade he has right now, so yeah. The, Mir the Mirage missions are, uh, are pretty useful for... Um, they do have um, some like bonuses for doing some of them like you get max HP increased or oh wow these things are so much better now those like gorilla type unversed or you get uh uh Xehanort reports or you get Keyblades for example here or you even get uh I believe there's some cases where you get the command styles for I don't know if like all of them have a, I think yeah they might have command style specifically in each for all three of them. But yeah, these are basically like the last unversed we need to see here that aren't those special inversed unversed that are like unversed mission based. So yeah, uh, here's yeah. If I desired your assistance, I'd have demanded it. We had the situation under control. Isn't that right, Smee? Oh, yes, Captain, completely. We would have cleaved those fiends to the brisket, we would. Why, I'd have given him a little of this and this. And don't think your efforts mean you'll get a share of me treasure, understand? I'm not after your precious box, Captain. I'm looking for a person. A boy wearing a mask. Ring any bells? No, not a one. Figures. It's me, you blithering barnacle. We're off. We shall leave this place before the light draws them back again. Huh? Hey, hold on. What did you just say about the light? Ah, yes, it's heartbreaking, really. This chest, you see, contains light gathered from all around. And I've got an acquaintance, a boy, who's sure to try and seize it. A boy who's after the light. If it's not Vanitas, then who? Hey, why don't I help you keep the light safe? Maybe you could tell me more about this boy who's troubling you. What's his name? Peter Pan! <laughs> This chest must be brought to Skull Rock safely. Don't let that Peter Pan anywhere near it. Right. I got you covered. Have you sensed the pattern with all of Terra's missions from the world, basically? He always... He doesn't mean to, but he kind of helped out the villains. So, yeah. Now, I actually like Neverland in here better than Kingdom Hearts 1 or in Chain of Memories because you actually get to visit Neverland, not Captain Hook's pirate ship. So yeah, that's actually pretty cool that we actually get to see Neverland here. But unfortunately, 
we will never learn to fly. Yeah. Uh, okay, so we can't go this way. This is the Indian camp. I don't know, you actually get something special if you can, like, fly all the way up there and excuse me for a second. Okay, sorry about that. Uh, well, my, my mom called me. And then one of my friends brought uh, some nice hot buns over, so... I ate like a few of those. Before I start recording again. But then I was like, oh. I probably need to start recording again. So I saw this last one. Him and his girlfriend were at, um, were at Texas Roadhouse, so. Yeah, and they brought a few ones over back, and they're like, hey, you might just want some, so. I thank them for thinking of me like that. Okay. Alright. We are going to Skull Rock to get that treasure box. Okay. For Captain Hook. Actually, the story for Terrors at Neverland, I think, is actually pretty short compared to the other trees. Not 100% sure. It's been a while. I don't even think we go this way. But... Okay, this isn't the way to go, but... Why is it letting us go this way? I don't know. The cinnamon body. For those bunch. Oh, amazing. I'm sorry if you can hear my chewing yeah. I'm trying not to do it right in front of the mic. But don't worry, I'm... I mean, it's kind of hard not to do it in front of the mic when... The mic can literally pick up anything within like a 50 yard... Within like... It can pick up a lot of stuff, and I'm trying to learn why it keeps doing that. Like, I don't want to pick up that much stuff, but... It keeps picking up stuff, so... Picking up something I don't want it to. Like it could, li it could have, not could have. It picks up the sound from my uh, sweet mate's room. I mean, sure, I'm pretty close to um, their wall in terms of setup for me. So yeah, this was not the way we wanted to go. Also, if I never mentioned that, but. Good place to get um, treasures and a sticker. Oh, come on. And this is a mimic. Or spider chest, whatever they're called. I actually like the. Those are probably one of my favorite unversed. Uh, oh, come on. Sucker. I'll try it one more time and then I'll just. Go on my merry way. Yay, we got rainbow sticker. I don't understand Limit Storm. I seriously don't. And we're gonna, yep, no more is going to show up, so. No waste of treasure impact. Alright, now that we got some treasure out of the way here. Oh, I guess there's more in this. I just never walked it there. Alright. How about we go... Sorry about that. That was my water. How about we go... Do the actual mission. I'm not finding these guys anymore. Because... Before we even go to the final world... We are going... I'm going to do a major grind session off screen. So you guys don't have to see it. Yeah. I seriously wish... If they said you couldn't go this way for Terry, because then 
Well then I guess you want to know which way to go, but then you'd still be confused as hell as where to go. Because you'd be like, um, there's no other way. Except over there. And there's of course treasures over here. And yeah, you can swim too, but it's not like, well, swimming's fun. I was going to say swimming's fun. Ooh, Dark Haze. That's actually a pretty cool move for Terra. Obviously it's a Terra exclusive move because it has a move. Move. It has the name Dark in it, so it's like automatically assume that is only for Terra because it is. All right, let's yeah. get. I'm not looking forward to the unversed mission for this world. I mean, what can I say? I never even showed off any of the inverse missions. I'll show off maybe one of them. I don't want to show off all of them. Because there's... The deep space one is a pain in the ass. Believe me. It's kind of like the, um... Uh, it's kind of like the one... It's kind of like Mushroom 3, I think it was? The one at Beast Castle in Kingdom Hearts, uh... Two final mix where it drops orbs and you gotta pick them up, but instead, but for that unversed, you gotta hit it in order for it to drop orbs, and you try not to get hit and you're timed, obviously. So, yeah, it's kind of it's a bastard, it is such a bastard. I will not show that one off. I'll probably show off the one in Disney Town. I actually like that one. Mainly because of the music that plays for it. Now, if you want to actually... Okay. There we go. I'm like, why is that not getting rid of rock? Because that actually reveals a treasure chest. And there's, a, of course, another fake... Big chest here. Big chest, big chest, big chest. Like I said, they are probably... I don't want to keep hitting that one. I want to hit this one. Oh, I won't be having Twisted Hours for my finisher that much longer. The only reason I have it on there is because they have so many other finishers. And this one, like, goes up to my other... Goes up to one of his other finisher moves. Yeah. I don't... know. this isn't where... This is, I was thinking that this is where his, um, this is where the, uh, rare unversed are for Terra, but that's not true. Oh, oh, oh my god. Yeah, that's good. I'm not getting those treasure chests. I, I don't know how long I was gone for, so I don't know how far, how far along this video actually is. Okay. Why don't these rocks? Whatever, I'm done. I don't want to fight you guys anymore. I'm gonna go to Skull Rock or what's his name? Captain Hook. Because I trust them apparently. Yeah. All right, this is actually, I actually like this area of the of Neverland. All right, now you gotta examine this boat in order to go to Skull Rock. And with that quick um, trip. Now this, I know, this is where the, the, um, Rare on verse show up for Terra, but I don't remember what part. I think. Okay, don't hit the treasure chest. I think they show up up here. Oh my gosh, seriously, another fake one? Get dead it. Okay, you can't enter that way. It's like, 
But we don't want to enter that way quite yet because we're not done exploring the front of Rock Skull. Skull Rock. I can't remember the significance of Skull Rock in the movie. Oh, here we are. Then again, it's been such a long time since I've seen the seen the movie that. That it kind of, um, yeah, it's been so long since I've seen the movie that I, I barely even remember anything in that movie. Anyway, let's enter Skull Rock. Oh, cutscene doesn't play out right away. Ooh, Arsola. I guess the cutscene plays out right away when you enter the actual entrance and not one of the eye sockets. And the only reason I'm coming out of the eye socket so I can go into this eye socket to get the treasure chest on the other side, hopefully. Because I know if I try to get to the treasure chest, if I try to, like, um... I guess it wouldn't have. Alrighty, then. I guess I actually have to be down there. Oh, well. Well done. Pardon me, Captain, but it's about that shooting star I was mentioning to ye. Mr. Smee, I ordered you to drop that. I'll not have you gushing on about some shooting star. Yeah, but, but Captain, most shooting stars twinkle for a bit and then they go out. But this one, it, it kept on sparkling and shining even after it crashed down. Why, what if it's really a big, enormous, priceless gemstone? Idiot! Why didn't you tell me? Hmm? <clears throat> We've a bit of business to attend to and must, I fear, step away. I trust you can see to things till I return? Sure. When Peter Pan gets here, I'll be waiting. Codfish. Looks like he's found himself a new flunky. I'll fly down and distract him. Men, you move in and nab the treasure. Are you Peter Pan? That's me. The light is not yours to take. Put Peter Plant in his place. I will most certainly do that. You won't stop me. No offense to people, but I do not like Peter Pan that much. He is kind of a dick. And me being able to kick the living shit out of him, all the more better. Even though we didn't really take all of his HP down. But hey, we learned Blade Charge, so that's a plus earlier though oh well what do you want with the light light what light look pan we got the chest no not yet you blockheads hey Now what is this? Pirate treasure, of course. Jewels, doubloons, you know, the usual stuff. I've been guarding a pile of loot? Sounds like you've been tricked. I'll say. I owe you an apology. I picked a fight over nothing. Oh, it was all in good fun. Not every day I get to fight such a good swordsman. Say, what's your name anyway? Tara. Right then, Tara. Which way did Hook go? They said something about a shooting star. Shooting star? Tinkerbell must be in danger! Men, guard that treasure with your lives! Aye, aye, sir! You go and get him, Pan! Well, I should be on my way.
And we get Terra's final D-Link, Peter Pan. Also, when you do the command board, uh, you meet Pete sometimes when you get on special things and you forge a D-Link with him. That was a uh, Kingdom Hearts, Birth by Sleep, North American, anywhere outside of Japan exclusive until Final Mix came out and then Japan got it. So yeah, that's cool. I'll explain more of that when I talk more about the command decks or the command board. Oh no, we gotta save those two Lost Boys. Which I actually like that they have the Lost well, well, two of them. They have two of the Lost Boys in here. That's actually pretty cool. Something that was lagging in the first Neverland world when it showed up. Unversed. Stay back. Yep, we just have to defeat the countless unverse, kind of like how we had to do it with uh, when we were in Olympus Coliseum with Ven. But it's pretty easy if you have moves that can hit multiple enemies at once, like shot locks. And I kind of wish I didn't have this shot lock, but you know it's fine. And if you have magnet. And thunder. So yeah, this is actually the final portion of Neverland. And so yeah. Also, one thing you want to do, like once you beat the main story for Terra, and I think you have to do it for all three of them as well. You can go into. You remember that tree we saw in one of the places? That's actually Peter Pan's house, and you can go in there. So yeah. And there's treasure chests in there, so you might want to do that. You sure cut that monster down to size. <laughs> Ahoy! How fare ye, lad? Hook! Go hide. Fine. All's well. What's that? Tinkerbell, one of Peter Pan's dearest friends. Can I take a look? So long as I have his precious pixie, Pan's demise is all but assured. <laughs> What's the meaning of this? You know, I didn't give it that much thought. Just doing what my heart tells me. That's mutiny! And you'll walk the plank for it! <gasps> that sound! star up there is another world. Huh? Terra. Yep. Hard to believe there are so many worlds out there besides our own. The light is their hearts. And it's shining down on us like a million lanterns. What? I don't get it. In other words, they're just like you, Ben. What does that mean? You'll find out someday, I'm sure. I want to know now. treasures. 
Did you guys really want the jewels and gold that badly? Hmm? Nah, we don't care about that stuff. Uh, but a uh, pan was counting on us. I'll tell you what. Put the stuff that's really special to you in there. That can be your treasure. Yeah! yeah! Real swell idea! Thanks! <gasps> Kinda makes me wonder what I'd put in there. 